Well, this week on the Suffer Club, me and Tyler get prepared for the Fellowship of the Idiots. And we head back to week three of the Winter Short Track Series where Tina puts in a massive effort. I get gutted in the men's sport, 19 to 39 category, and let's find out what the Fellowship of the Idiots is all about. Fellowship of the Idiots is a 19.7 mile run from the YMCA to Morrow Mountain. You should get there by the time the sun rises and then you run back. So today we are out in Roco, which is Rowan County, and uh, we're going to log some miles. So Tyler and I are consistent short distance runners, and today we just tried to see how we will feel at the halfway point. We know we have 19.7 to go, so we logged 10 today. One of the difficult parts of this run is the 300 plus feet in 7 tenths of a mile. It's not the climb I'm worried about, it's the descent. You destroy your legs on the descents, so today we added a little bit of elevation just to see how we'd feel. So we're at Sloan Park in Mount Ola, four miles into a 10 mile run. There was restrooms over there, so we figured we would just stop. It's an old mill, a little water mill down there, feeling good. So back when me and Tyler used to ride a lot, we used to come out here quite often we call this area the glory land because it's just big open fields and very little cars. You just enjoy it. Nine miles in, very close to the finish. Man, this is a beautiful day. Nice little breeze. The Fellowship of the Idiots next week. It's gonna be a good one. It's gonna be a push. A test for both of us you know so it's gonna be a lot of fun if you can make it out there hey comment on this video we'd love to connect with you we will see you next week for the fellowship of the idiots so this was on saturday and i have the winter short track on sunday so let's see what happens what up look at that so miss tina bigford showed up again in her suffer club shirt repping and did such a great job taking herself back to the podium for a second place so to know Tina's backstory is a big deal. A few years ago, Tina was taken out by a motor vehicle and she got herself back on the bike and gosh, is such a stinking strong rider. And she's only been mountain biking for under two years. Bravo, Miss Tina Bickford. And she's a grandmother. So yeah, take that. Very proud, very proud. Second. Yeah! So I didn't have the GoPro on me today. This guy right here, John Bigford, videoed. Here's the footage. On the inside, Aaron on the inside. Good job, good job. Way to use the running. Use them wheels. Yeah, so my legs were aching from the beginning. I did it to myself. I know I should not have ran, but I did. Reel him in, you got it. See, this is one of the things I love about the Suffer Club is the encouragement. John and Tina everywhere yelling at me, telling me to keep digging. This is the side of the Suffer Club that I love, the encouraging side. Honestly, the Suffer Club is just a big cheerleading squad. See, we love to celebrate the people that give it their everything. It's not about making it to the podium. It's just about giving everything that you have and being proud because you gave it everything you had. Atta boy. Woo ah, Aaron Beaver. It's, oh, nine. There we are. And like that, less than an hour after my race, I am at the Charlotte Douglas Airport and flying to Utah. And so we hope you enjoyed this week's Suffer Club. If you did, give it a thumbs up. If you're going to be at the Fellowship of the Idiots, be sure to say hello, and we will see you at the Winter Short Track Series for week four. Remember, be proud of the results you get from the effort that you put in, and we will see you next week. Adios.